Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem thirty-three in chapter twenty-eight. Chapter twenty-eight is about sources of magnetic field. This is the application about the magnetic field on axis of a dipole. And there we can see in first cases the position that from the dipole is x one. The x one we can consider the radius of the earth because it says the position. Is just at the north pole, right? So from the north pole to the center of this dipole, we can see is the center of the Earth is the radius. So radius of Earth six three eight zero kilometer. So we write it as x one, and we know at this position the magnetic field is b one. Mm -hmm. At another position x two, that is thirteen thousand. Kilometer above the surface of the Earth, right? So the distance can be write as s two as a thirteen thousand kilometer plus this is the radius of Earth. We write it there and ask you what is the magnetic field at this position. We need to know b two. So this is very easy and straightforward. We can just write down the equation to describe magnetic field on an axis of a magnetic dipole. So mu naught divided by two pi. This mu is magnetic dipole. This is a distance from the position to the dipole center, right? So this is a function for b one. This is function for b two. If we want to know b two, we can use b two over b one. B two over b one. We can say the ratio is become s two cube over x one cube. And then solve this equation. We can get function for b two. Input all the given quantities. You can get answer there. Thank you.